Hi, hope you're all doing okay today. Um, welcome back to another day of living on a pound a day. I think for breakfast this morning I'm going to make some pancakes, so yeah, let's get to it. So the trick to these pancakes is once they've got some bubbles on top and the edge starts to come up you can just slide under and flip it over um, and it should be nice and brown on the bottom and then you just leave it there for a few seconds while it cooks um, I'll show you what it looks like when it's done. So depending on how toasty you like them that's pretty much done for me but you can leave it cooking for a bit longer if you want to. I decided that I would make pancakes today um, just to see if I could come up with any other recipes for um, the oats. So I used um, oats, water and then a tiny little piece of my banana and then I used the rest of my banana chopped up on top of it. It looks so good so I hope that it tastes really nice too. Oh, I also used a little pinch of cinnamon in the batter just so that it tasted a bit more like flavour. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'll dig into these. They look professional, they don't look like they're on a budget at all. So. It was so good. I think that if I made them ever again, I would put more cinnamon in and I would probably use more banana just to make them a little bit sweeter, but they were definitely edible and I really actually enjoyed those. The bananas were really sweet because they're so ripe, so yeah, really, really good. <laughs> so I'm gonna go make myself some tea now. I'm not really sure what I'm gonna make. Um, I'm just gonna see what ingredients I've got left and maybe try and make something with those burgers I made the other day. I might have them with rice or something, so yeah, I'll go and raid the kitchen and see what I can come up with. So I decided that I'm going to make some tomato sauce with the tomatoes that I've got and then hopefully just pour that on the top to make it a bit more of an interesting meal. Um, I'm probably going to have rice with the burgers and then this as a sauce so yeah. <laughs> I've just added a few spices to the tomatoes because they're really cheap tomatoes and so they're quite sour so they need a bit of something sweet to make it taste a bit better. Um, so yeah I've just put a bit of um, sugar and pepper into there. And they're just bubbling away nicely. <laughs> so this is starting to thicken up really nice. I just wanted a really nice thick tomato sauce to go with them burgers. I think it'll be really delicious. So I'm going to reheat these guys in a pan so that they're nice and warm again. They're still quite crispy from the oven but yeah, they need to be hot. Hear me over the kettle boiling, but I just remembered that I've got frozen vegetables, so I'm going to put some of those in to have on the side as well. So to say I didn't know what I was cooking like 20 minutes ago, this turned out really, really good. Um, I've got quite the feast here. I plan on pouring the sauce over the top of the whole meal. I don't think it'll look very photogenic by then, um, but the tomato sauce is delicious. If you've never put sugar um, and 
a little bit of pepper into your tomato sauce and you need to try it because it's delicious. I told you it wouldn't look very appealing. <laughs> Hopefully it tastes good. Mm. Who needs cutlery anyway? I'm really impressed with how all of the meals today turned out and I've really enjoyed eating all of them and I haven't felt deprived yet. Um, so yeah, and I felt so full the whole time that I've not really craved anything bad as well. Well, at least for the last few days. <laughs> so yeah, um, I hope that you enjoyed this video and that I hope to see you again tomorrow. I'll be doing the same thing again for the next two days um, and uploading for the next two days as well. So if you liked what you saw then please give me a like and please consider subscribing if you're new and have a wonderful day wherever you are in the world. Alright, bye!